to attempt to defeat Alduin, Sahrot Hun. The Nords have had many heroes since, but none greater. Vormendark, I do not know. Perhaps in the very doing, they erased the knowing of it from time itself. The Dove are children of Akatosh. Thus, we are specially attuned to the flow of time. Perhaps also uniquely vulnerable. I warned them against such a rash action. Even I could not foresee its consequences. Nust Lihon, they would not listen. Yes, there were a few of us that rebelled against Alduin's Thur, his tyranny. We aided the humans in his overthrow. But they did not trust us, me of. Their inner counsels were kept hidden from us. I was far from here on the day of Alduin's downfall, but all Dove felt the sundering of time itself. I cannot tell you in detail. I never heard it used. Korgan. It was the first Thum created solely by mortals. It was said to force a dragon to experience the concept of mortality. A truly von Mindoran. Incomprehensible idea to the immortal Dove. I have taught the way of the voice for centuries, and the Thum since long before that. But no, Dovakin. Others do not come here to train anymore. Saran, you are the first in over a hundred years. I meditate on the Rotmulag, the words of power. I counsel in their use. It is enough for me. Knowing a word of power is to take its meaning into yourself. Contemplate the meaning of a Rotmulag. You will become closer to that word as it fills your inner self. Will I teach you, Dovakin? What word calls you to deeper understanding? There are three to master. Fus, Faim, and Yol. In your tongue, the word simply means fire. It is change given form, power at its most primal. That is the true meaning of Yol. Solyek, power, you have it, as do all Dove. But power is inert without action and choice. Think of this as the fire builds in your Sum, in your breath. Sum Ark Mora. What will you burn? What will you spare? Which calls to you, Dovakin? Fus, Faim, or Yol? Fade in your tongue. Mortals have greater affinity for this word than the Dove. Everything mortal fades away in time, but the spirit remains. Ponder the meaning of spirit. Unslad Zi, where mortal flesh may wither and die, the spirit endures. That is fine. Let that meaning fill you. 
Sum Ark Mora. You will find that your spirit will give you more strength. Which calls to you, Dovahkiin? Fus, Faim, or Yol? It is called Force in your tongue. But as you push the world, so does the world push back. Think of the way Force may be applied effortlessly. Imagine but a whisper pushing aside all in its path. That is Fus. Let its meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora. You will push the world harder than it pushes back. Drem your look, greetings. Look thum. 